This video is sponsored by Skillshare. Hey everyone, today we're doing something super fun. <laughs> today I am going to be wearing a wig for 24 hours without a wig cap. wigs for about three years now and I know how important it is to wear a wig cap underneath your wig especially when my hair started growing out and now I have hair that I have to hide to be able to wear a wig and have it not be obvious you know this video was actually suggested a long time ago by one of my viewers so if that was you shout out let's see how long it takes for my hair to start coming out from underneath a wig. This is the wig that I have selected for me to wear for the next 24 hours. Um, it is human hair, it is blonde, it is a lace front. This is what she looks like on the inside, so these will help a lot. Hopefully, let's do um, a little hairstyle so that my hair can stay underneath. The wig. There's a couple different hairstyles you can do to get your hair as flat as possible underneath a wig. So I'm going to make two braids and then we're going to swirl them around my head and bobby pin them down. And now I'm going to cross them like this. We're gonna pin it just like that. Wow! A look! Today I'm going to be using Isha Luxury Wig Fashion Absolute Lace Wig Bond. Great stuff. Love her. Oh boy, this is gonna be something. <laughs> it just pulls on every piece of my hair because my hair doesn't have anywhere to go. <laughs> hey, oh, we're doing good. <gasps> we're doing good. <gasps> Oh, there we go. She is glued. She's not pretty, but she's on. Set the timer. Let's see what happens. First things first, we gotta clean this up a little bit. <laughs> okay, I think we're looking pretty good. Koda, how do I look? Ah! Thank you. While I was straightening it, I think I was a little intense there. The side did lift up a bit, but if I press it down, it's still a little sticky. So we're just gonna roll with it. Oh. I hate that I got such a late start on the day because the sun goes down so early now. Take me with you. What do you think? It's good. My office is an absolute mess. While I'm sitting here at my desk, I can show you all today's sponsor. Today's sponsor is Skillshare. Skillshare is by far my favorite learning platform with thousands of inspiring classes for creative people like me. Skillshare is a great place to explore new skills, deepen your passions, and inspire new ideas. With class topics including cinematography, illustration, graphic design, photography, video, music, and more, there's something for everyone. Plus, so many classes are taught by exciting, knowledgeable people who want you to succeed. There's also no ads, and they're always launching new premium classes. So be sure to keep an eye out for those. I've taken a couple classes on Skillshare so far, but my favorite right now is learning cinematography basics from HBO cinematographer Zach Milligan to learn new techniques for my Instagram photos and my videos. And I'm not the only one taking this class. You can see in the corner there's 421 people also watching this class. It's kind of cool. Skillshare is offering the first 1,000 people who click the link in the description down below a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership. So, make sure to click the link down below if you're interested. Thank you so much, Skillshare. And then back to 24 hours wearing this wig. I just got an email from Depop that one of the clothes I ordered just got here. So, I might have new clothes to try on. <gasps> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, wait. Ah, I'm. Oh my gosh, something's in my sock. Ow, ow, ow. Being outside is a death trap. Da, 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 da. Oh my gosh, she sent me a scrunchie and stickers. Thank you so much for your purchase. Oh my gosh, Tiffany. What I actually got from her are these um, stockings. Like, look at how frilly the top is. Two hours later. Ugh. Oh my god, it's sliding a lot. Oh my gosh, it looks so bad already. I am embarrassed. It's dark out. Look it. I'm gonna make food. I'm gonna relax. 
I have to take this lipstick off first. I'll probably put a hat on. <laughs> Do you want some food, buddy? Wait, yeah, wait, yeah, okay, wait. We'll pretend you didn't already see me. Action! Oh my god! Do you like it? I love it! These lights are bright in here. I'm gonna make pasta. I was gonna make ramen. <laughs> <gasps> Some people call me a master chef. Some people don't call me a master chef. It's time for our nightly ritual of Teen Whoa. Who's your favorite? Styles. Who's your favorite? Styles Zelensky. Who's your favorite? Is Say that? Styles. Also Lydia. Also Lydia. Yeah, Lydia. yeah, Lydia and the Styles. Who's your least favorite character? Oh. Hmm. Oh my god, Scott's dad. Peter. Oh. Peter, but he's kind of <laughs> he's kinda cute sometimes, so. <laughs> Yeah, I also really like Isaac. <gasps> yeah. Isaac's okay. We just watched Teen Wolf for a couple hours. And now it's time for bed. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Yes, I do have a dinosaur on my pajama shirt. And yes, my wig is falling off fast. <laughs> you can see all the glue here on my hairline. Now caked with a... Uh, makeup <laughs> and it seems as though the only part of my wig holding on is the hair literally right here um i don't know how well sleeping is gonna go because for the last couple nights i haven't been sleeping very well and i've been tossing and turning so um, it's time for me to go to bed um uh, let's see what the wig looks like in the morning longer than I thought it was going to. Do any of you think you could last longer wearing a wig without a wig cap? I don't know. Comment down below. Let me know. Thank you again Skillshare for sponsoring this video. And remember, if you are one of the first 1,000 people to click the link down below, then you get a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership. So make sure to do that. I'll see you next time. Bye!